So welcome to my YouTube channel. Once again, I am back with another interesting question. So in the figure shown, we have a right triangle. The three sides of this right triangle are given as B, A and the hypotenuse H. The perimeter of this right triangle is given as 220 units and its area is 990 units. We have to find the dimensions of this right triangle. Also there is a star mark here which says that side B is greater than side A. So let us start solving this question. So the information that is given to us is the perimeter is 220. So from here we will get A plus B plus H is equal to 220. This will be our first equation. The area is given as 990. So from here we will get half times B times A is equal to 990 or we can write AB is equal to 990 multiplied with 2 so which this will be 1980 this is the second equation also because it is a right triangle so another equation will come into picture that is using Pythagorean theorem that will be a square plus b square equals h square. So now we have three equations and we have three unknowns. So using these three equations we have to find the unknowns. So let us do one thing. Because we have the value of a square plus b square, what we can do is we can take this first equation and we can rewrite it as a plus b equals 220 minus h. Now we can square it on both sides. So this will be a squared plus b squared plus 2ab equals 220 square which will be 48400 minus 2ab that means 440h plus h square. Now in place of a square plus b square we can replace from equation 3 h square. So this will be h square plus 2 times ab. So ab is given to us as 1980 from equation 2. So this will be 2 times 1980 equals 48400 minus 440h plus h squared. Now we will subtract h square from both sides. So this and this will get cancelled. Let us multiply this. So this will be 3960 equals 48400 minus 440H. On rearranging, we will get 440H equals 48400 minus 3960. So 440H will be equal to 440. H will be equal to 44440 upon 440. Let us simplify this. We can cancel these two zeros and then we can uh, simply see that this is divisible by 44. So this will be 101. So H we have got as 101 units. So let us write here in place of H we can write 101. Now let us substitute the value of uh, this h in equation 1. So this will give us a plus b plus 101 equals 220. From here we will get a plus b equals 220 minus 101 is 119. Also from equation number 2 we can express b in terms of a. So this will be a plus in terms of a, B can be written as 1980 from A. From here we can cross multiply. So 1980 by A will be B equals 119. Now we will multiply small a on both sides. So this will be A square 
plus 1980 equals 119A. So if we rearrange it, we will get a quadratic equation A square minus 119A plus 1980 equals 0. So this is the quadratic equation that will give us the value of small a. Let me erase this part. So we will use the quadratic formula to find the value of a. So a will be equal to negative of minus 119 plus minus square root of 100 negative of 119 whole square minus 4 times 1 times 1980 upon 2 times 1. So this will be positive 119 plus square root of 119 square will be 14161 minus 4 times 1980 will be 7920 divided by 2. So this will give us 119 plus minus square root of 14161 minus 7920 will be 6241 whole divided by 2. Further on simplification it will give us 119 plus minus square root of 6241 is 79 divided by 2. So from here A will be 119 plus 79 upon 2 or A can be 119 minus 79 upon 2. So 119 plus 79 will be 198 divided by 2 that is 99 units or 119 minus 79 will be 40 divided by 2 will be 20. So the two possible values for A is either 99 or 20. Now if the value of A is 99, B will be equal to, we know that it is 1980 upon A, so divided by 99. So this will be 20. This is not possible because the value of B is less than the value of A. But in question it is explicitly mentioned that B must be greater than A. So we will reject this possibility. We will take A equal to 20 and from here we will get B equals 1980 upon 20. So this will be 99. So here b is greater than a so we will accept this value so finally we have found h is equal to 101 b equals 99 and a equal to 20. so if you want more such videos do subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video